Hey y'all, what's up? It's me, Tori and Goddess, coming in with a quick message. Y'all know what I'm coming to do. Bring the actual factuals. Confirm what you already know or let you know what's hidden. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Put a strong arm, whatever color heart, and some footsteps down there, y'all. Let me know y'all still rocking with me. Thank you to everybody who rocking with me. Y'all know ain't nothing but love here. I don't want nobody on the shit brick road. If it's up to me, everybody had a perfect life. But we have to have these lessons though, right? Gotta have these lessons so we can elevate. So we can elevate in our mind, our emotions. Learn to live above emotional influence. And first and foremost, you know, become more spiritually aware out here in this matrix. The G said, you two are meant to be together. Y'all may have been fighting. Somebody got slapped. Somebody got slapped. Um, but y'all meant to be together. Um, some counseling needed. Is this a long-term relationship, a marriage? We don't want no domestic violence cases. Not only do they leave physical bruises, blemishes on our body, but your record, your emotional well-being, your mental stability... Your overall spiritual well-being. Somebody lost though, right? It was it was it was written in heaven. It was your relationship. It was already written. Something you're supposed to be going through. These lessons. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, you do. The G said you already hit, but you you coming to realize it. Yeah, you recognizing, analyzing, and realizing that damn. This is some spiritual warfare out here, and I ain't got nothing but haters around me right now. And you ain't feeling that. Stay alert. Stay alert, the G said. Yeah, they want you to be more alert and want you to... It's a deadline of some sort, too. You, you, you got to go over your mail, some documents in your mail. I feel like you've been forming bonds to understand. This is what the G said. You've been forming bonds to understand religious beliefs, Christianity, Islam, Hinduism, Juda Judaism, Jehovah's Witness. You syncretize and going beyond research to harmonize your own belief system, right? Yeah, we're becoming a little bit more spiritual. And while we're doing that, our eating habits going to have to change. The G said, you got some poor eating habits, right? <laughs> they want you to develop better eating habits. These haters, though. Mm, mm, mm. Haters. Haters. Hater alert. We always got some haters, though. Let's see what's good. No weapons formed against us shall prosper. Thank you, Most High. Thank you, Spirit Guides and Ancestors. Thanks to our brother Jesus. We got our ascended masters around us. Our, our, our spirit guides, our ancestors, our... Our archangels. We got some of our old school spirit guys, and we got some that's new who are encamped around us, just waiting for us to say go. Waiting for us to say go. They can't interfere your free will because we was given that. You know what I'm saying? We was given that by Most High, and we was given that built-in GPS system. Period. Point blank. Somebody need to use their third eye. You wise beyond your years already. The G says you got an old school knowledge. You're very gifted, right? Don't put it on the back burner. You know, I always say that. Don't put it on the back burner. Earth energy. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Something going on this winter coming up. Next season, honey. Next season. Yeah. I got some feminine energy. Earth energy. That's where your safety and success is going to be, right? Somebody had great intentions in the past. Some air energy. Gemini. Feel as though they got on your nerves. Could be a fire sign as well, but they backtrack too much, right? They backtrack a lot. Could be a Sagittarius. Fire sign and air energy, right? But it's about to be some winds of change. You weren't on the same page with this person, right? They was game guiding you, um... But they always seem to delve back into their past and then want to come back to you when 
shit don't work out. And be like, I only want you. Bullshit, the G said. Your family values is up. I feel as though um, you got a Gemini in your energy, too. This Gemini, my earth sign, um, they the bacon bringer and cooker. But they, you know, they, they dipped on you. They dipped on you. They did. They went on some sort of vacation. Y'all was separated physically, energetically. Communication was cut off. I also feel like, you know, the respect level. Where was it? Where was it? The G said you ain't even move out your own way, though, my earth sign. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. You you ain't move out your own way. Um, you asked for most high's help, but when you got... When you got your prayers answered, you got those intuitive messages and those downloads, you put those on the back burner. The G says you're leading with them panties or them boxers. That's what you're leading with. you wishful thinking when it's already been put in your face. Yeah, people change, but has this person changed? This person may be your backup. You they backup for sure. They was reliable in the past. Yeah, they supported you left field. You know, they backed you up in the right field, too. They they put you on the pedestal. You know what I'm saying? But you, you understand in the ways and the ins and outs of this person's um family. Yeah. They got some soul ties. Something that was already meant and written. Um, they under a spiritual soul contract with somebody. Um, could be a marriage. Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. Feel as though you got some grief, though. You got some grief going on, or they may have some grief going on. Y'all think about one another on a regular basis. Y'all stay in each other's energy. Y'all may be communicating, although this person is married, right? They miss you. You miss them. But the G said, remove yourself. Remove yourself is what the G said. You're not an afterthought. There's something going on in this person's life to where they want to, I want to run to you. They want to run to you. They want to run to you is what the G said. Now, but this person, you all walk this matrix in another life. Mm -hmm. This person was your person at one point in time. Yeah, they was your person at one point in time, but they got this fake-ass player energy. Yeah, they got this fake-ass player energy, and they are going through some karma. I feel like somebody pulled a, a them on them. Mm -hmm. There's some secrets coming out, too. I feel as though it's been some shit hidden, right? It's been some shit hidden. It's going to fall out like bones. Like bones, like people be having skeletons in the closet. It's going to fall out because people got haters, right? People got haters. You and this person got haters. Um, everything is divinely guided, though. That's what the G said. But you leading with your panties or your boxers. Like you want to stuff them in their mouth and vice versa. Yeah, we going to keep it absolutely gangster. Somebody got cobwebs. Whoever this message is intended for, you got cobwebs, sis, bruh, and you want to backtrack. You used to backtracking. It's like, I know what I'm going to get with this person, but don't you know it's going to be 10 times harder because you're going to bump your head against the shit brick road again? Mm -hmm. And it's going to be powerful because these sports that they pick up and throw on your back this time, goddamn it, it's going to be like you can't even get them out. They lying. They lying. Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, they lying. They two-faced it. They real ain't never been your real. They real ain't never been your real. And if this is a twin flame connection, you know, sometimes twin flames, if not oftentimes, we're not meant to be with them. It's a spiritual journey. They the catalyst for our spiritual awareness and for us to tap into that God-given, built-in GPS system, goddammit. It's what the G said. They have already changed their address. Mm -hmm. Energetically, they just trying to see what it do. Boo boo. G says you mess around and uh, you know when you lay down with dogs, you wake up with fleas. Take that where it resonate. Take it where it resonate. They want you to stay prayed up. Leo, Sagittarius. <coughs> excuse me, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, energy. Your actions speak real, right? You've been in your feelings a lot lately about being on the solo dolo. 
Put that positivity out into the universe. Speak it into existence. I don't feel as though you pray for this person. You pray for a person. Shit ain't that bad right now, the G said. But some shit need to be critiqued and evaluated. A fine tuning is needed. I feel as though you playing games with yourself. You juggling too. Out of some, out of, in spite of you being betrayed, right? But you being solo dolo, you on your destined path. Because this is not a Tina and Rick type of love. No, this is more like Tina Turner and um, what's love got to do with it? Because you won't be the only person. You won't. You won't be the only person, she said. Mm-mm. These poor eating habits, though, we're going to get those together. We're going to get those together because while we are leveling up, we need to be nourished properly with no low vibrational foods. I'm, 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 I'm talking and I need to be doing it, too. I'm going to take a page up out of this message book because this ain't nothing but spirit. They here. So, they want you to pray on these, um, they said Jezebel. This Jezebel spirit that is trying to creep up into your realm of being because they said this is not who you have been. This person, you got two people at you whispering sweet nothings in your ear. Got you feeling as though you need to go and dip your toes into some Lake Minnetonka or you trying to lead by emotions. No, they want you to have some head over heart logic. When you lead by your emotions, they said you always be ass out. Mm-hmm. Something about to be made known to you. Fire energy. Yeah. Leo energy. And you're going to be like, shit. Let me stick my chest out and put my head up. God damn it. Like you got a, a book on your goddamn gone head. You're going to walk proud, the G said. Your soul. Your higher self, your soul going to thank you for whatever move you make next. They want you to plan, too, because you're going to accomplish what you want, material, happiness. Jot down these ideas. You know what I'm saying? These ideas that you got for this business or this next move as far as how you get your money. You got a lot of love around you. Feel as though you've been in hermit mode and you've been getting to know yourself, too. You still got a lot to learn about yourself because the G said you about to go down a shit brick road. But before they let you do that, they about to put something in your lap. They about to put something in your lap. So you will recognize, analyze, and realize that it is a shit brick road. Period. Point blank. 12.22 on the clock. Look it up. No treasure going down that road that you thinking of, sis. Ain't no treasure. Ain't no treasure. It's going to be some uh, a shit pot. A shit pot. It's going to be a shit pot. And that person that you're going towards, they stirring the shit pot. God damn it. They stirring the shit pot. The G said, temper yourself. Temper yourself. Some balance needs to be restored. You've been a little wild here. They said, um, but shit happens. Shit happens. Um, it's not what happens to you. It's how you react to what happens to you. Sometimes we need to, they said you a game god too. A lot of times you talk because you got lips because you want to pontificate everything. You taking some strides though. Being a truth seeker. They want you to seek out the truth of you. They want you to be tight lipped sometimes. I, they said you always in a political stance. You always want to debate. You want to show how smart you are. Show how smart you are that G said by surrendering to source. Because you've had these dilemmas in love and these career changes, you they want you to stay in a positive energy because they most definitely about to put you on a fresh start. It's got there's some new beginnings and some new cycles, and they don't want you to have no fear and to quit delving back into your past, they said. Your past is in the past for a reason. Your past in the past for a reason. Somebody in love with you, a possible fire sign, too. They said... They want you to step into your high priestess energy. You know, using this wisdom, that, that built-in um, GPS system, because you're very spiritually inclined. They said you, you you smart, too. They want you to use those scruples. Ain't no marbles lost. You just bored, is what they said. You just bored. Um, you know some secrets about this person. You You're very intuitive, right? And right now, your your intuition is 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 real fertile. Somebody in a new relationship, they want you to pay attention to that. They do. They want you to pay attention to that. That someone is in a new relationship. Um, fourteen forty four on the clock. 
people is in your rear view for a reason. They come in to tempt your tummy with the taste of nuts and honey. Take it where it resonates. Take it where it resonates. King, queen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This person got money issues. They do. This air energy, this Gemini Libra Aquarius don't have to be though, right? Could be this fire sign. You take it where it resonates though. Okay, but whoever it is, they've been on vacation because they was a finocket head. And they got some small worries and so do you. But they got a lot to fucking say about your family issues, right? They do. Somebody bisexual too. Somebody bisexual and they have a, a new beginning um, somewhere where... Or they partner may have a new beginning somewhere. They happy and successful there. They got some player energy. Um, feel like it's this air sign. They they bisexual. They they are. Um, king, queen. Um, I don't know how you feel about that. About people dipping their toes in other Lake Minnetonkas. That's not the same Lake Minnetonka. I don't know, but um, you don't feel like folks strapping up. So pay attention to that. Gemma Libra, Libra. Hmm. Gemini Libra Aquarius energy. They false. They're imposter. This reason. The reason why your G's want you to form a bond with them so you can pay attention to these intuitive downloads. This your confirmation. They said don't be perplexed and don't be embarrassed about shit. You got a change in your money coming too, right? They want you to decline the offer, but I don't feel as though you're going to decline the offer, but they want you to because it says no decline of offer because you, you're you um, in, a, in, a, in a lonely state of mind right now, the G said, but this person is pulling at your heartstrings. You got a lot of love for them. You had a lot of love for them in the past, vice versa. You know, it was mutual, but it's a lot of petty energy surrounding money. It's a lot of petty energy surrounding money. They have a bunch of anxiety about some money. And the genes said that you are a provider. Um, this person may be coming to you just to use you. And give you some. And give you some goddamn on Peter or some um, little Skeeter. You know what I'm talking about? The genes said work your mojo though. You the magical one. The law of attraction all around you. Love is around you. And they want you to expect miracles because you're being divinely guided. It may be a fire sign coming up on you. A little sexy. Mm -hmm. A little sexy coming up on you. Generous fire sign, they said. This person may have some jealousy. Um, They may be jealous about you, the G said. For real. But they may have some work issues. The G said, do that ring a bell? But they got some money coming, and they sweet on you. There's somebody in your past, too, though. It was some promises broken with this person. Mm -hmm. But you didn't have some advice about this person as well. So the G says you got some folk coming towards you who really not suitors because ain't no trust, no love, no abundance, no honor, or no loyalty. They got third parties, and it's too obvious that they want to cause some goddamn obstacles because they all been cheating, the G said. Weak and perverse and ugly energy. That was your reading. Um, I hope you make the right decision, sweetheart. I know you will, male or female. Let's stay sucker free. See you.